How do you find cash paying raving fans who will buy from you the quickest? Or how do you increase sales without selling? Here are the two most common problems I hear from business owners. One, cash flow. Two, more sales and customers. Most times they're looking for smarter sales strategies, smarter marketing strategies. They want to learn how to sell better, improve their website conversions, learn about SEO and digital marketing, etc. And yes, these are all very important. But there are two very important steps that need to happen before any of these other strategies take place. The first one is you need to position your business in a red hot niche. Two, you need to create your competitive edge so you stand out in the crowd. This is the starting point for any business or idea before anything else happens. Let me give you an example. You decide to go fishing and choose a pond and you don't get any bites. So you try a new bait. You change your fishing rod. You get up early. You try late at night. You try a bigger hook. You wear camouflage clothing. You change your deodorant. You try hiding in the bushes but still no fish. Why? Because there are no fish in the pond, only tadpoles. You are fishing in a niche that is not lucrative. Now if you shifted your position from where you are fishing right now, where there are no fish, to another pond across the road, which has thousands of fish starving and waiting for your bait, you will suddenly start to catch fish. So the analogy here is the fish ponds are your potential niches. And not every niche or pond is lucrative. So if you are fishing in a, non, in a non lucrative niche, in other words, if your business is positioned in a non lucrative niche where there are very little customers, or the customers are not interested in your product or service, it doesn't matter what you change, your bait, your rod, your reel, or in business terms, your sales pitch, your marketing flyers, your SEO strategy, or your website, or your new suit. If you're in a non-lucrative niche, your business will continue to struggle. No matter how hard you try, it's never going to work. I mentioned there are two steps. Step one is position your business in a red hot niche. You do not take your idea and try to pull an entire market to your business. That will never work. You need to find where the cash is flowing. And to do that, you find established markets that already have willing, ready to pay customers. And to move your business from where it is struggling right now into the lucrative sweet spots, you use the shift and sift method. This is how you tap into where the cash is flowing easily. In step two, you create your competitive edge so you stand out in the crowd. How do you do this? Firstly, what is your customer's ideal shopping experience? You need to know this. What three things make your customers angry and frustrated? Now you know these two things, you plug the gaps and become the business customers want to buy from. This is how you create your X factor, so you stand out in the crowd. This is how you become the blue goldfish amongst all the orange ones. Now if you want help to know exactly how to implement these two critical steps in your business, so you can improve cash flow and get more customers and sales. And if you want to learn how to discover your red hot niche of cash paying raving fans and how to create your competitive edge so you dominate your niche and become the business customers want to buy from, you may wish to grab a copy of my book that tells you exactly how to do this. Even if you have no idea or business right now, it's an Amazon bestseller it comes with an eight part video training course and workbooks and even support in my private Facebook support group in case you get stuck. So if that is of interest to you, grab a copy today.